<laughs> okay, before before I, I, I go into Indonesian, um, hi, uh, I know this language is all about the vocals, like, oh my god, vocals, so I'm gonna give you a piece of Korean music that has oh my god vocals. Um, it's actually in English, but it's a Korean artist. That's why I said Korean. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Anyway, um, Sohyang, uh, Bridge Over Troubled Waters. Just reacted to it. Mind blown. Uh, if you're into vocals, go check it out. Before this, after this, I don't care. Just uh, People need to know her. I didn't know her, and I was into Korean music for how long? Anyway, Mocha, I, I think. Uh, could be pronounced something else. Um, I was searching and looking and it's only like less than three minutes on each of her performances. So I think this might be the official video clip, but I'm not sure. Just gonna watch it anyway. It seems like the song would be sung as a childhood song, like Ring Around the Rosie, that type of stuff. What? I don't know why, but I, I have a feeling there's going to be like a dark twist or something. Okay, now it's kind of getting creepy, the song. What? It's a death notice. Um. Oh, okay, the places she went. Okay. Let's see. A performance, yeah, because that was just shush. Okay, okay. very childish and I don't mean that in a negative way I mean it as in kids or your inner child would be drawn to that song um, I have many groups that I 
clung to because of the childish factor. So I, I understand the appeal to this song. I just, no, not my cup of tea, but I have more from her. Definitely, I have a list. So you're not supposed to judge an artist by just one song because you never know. They might surprise you. I will come back to her. Um, I just, no, I just don't like this one. And that's okay. That's okay.